Welcome to the Crypto Lab channel. In this video, I will talk about Decentraland price prediction and Decentraland news today. If you like the video, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Write in the comments your price forecast for Decentraland in 2022. Decentraland Mana defines itself as a virtual reality platform based on the Ethereum blockchain that allows users to create, serve and monetize content and applications. In this virtual reality, users buy land that they can later navigate, build on, and monetize. Decentraland was launched following a $24 million initial coin offering, ICO, that took place in 2017. Virtual World launched its closed beta in 2019 and opened to the public in February 2020. Since then, users have created a wide range of experiences on their land sites, including interactive games, extensive 3D scenes, and many other interactive experiences. Decentraland was created by Ariel Milik and Esteban Ordano, who have retired from their core roles on the project, but are still working with Decentraland as advisors. So let's start with the most important news of the past days about Decentraland. So first news today about Mana Price Prediction. Attempts to breach descending trend line, targets $2.40 next. Mana Price remains negatively skewed moving in a tight range. The price action lacks conviction for a clear trend. Decentraland Mana is following a long-term descending resistance line with resistance of $5.91 Mana Price trades with losses on Tuesday. Expect a bounce toward $2.40 if breaks above the bearish slopping line. The downside is capped near $2.20. Mana price seeks short-term bounce. On the one-hour time frame, the mana price is showing strength and is in preparation to escape two immediate upside hurdles. If taken out successfully, mana price will be seeing interim upside target at the Horges have listed only 40 cryptocurrencies till now. On the other side, Coinbase alone has listed more than 150 coins on its platform. As per the report, there were more than 80 applications were waiting to be approved as the exchanges had to go through a lengthy process. Even widely circulated tokens such as Bitcoin and Ethereum have to face the same problems. Japanese exchanges users are reported held 1.18 trillion yen, $9.8 billion worth of cryptocurrency as of January. GMO coin handles 20 cryptocurrencies, which is the largest number of listings in the country. Some industry executives reportedly said that many traders flock to exchanges, such as Binance, partly due to the lack of options. JVCA's this decision will hopefully boost the coin listing in the country which will eventually help cryptocurrency adoption. The new measure will free up JVCA to spend more resources approving new cryptocurrencies as well as initial coin offerings and initial exchange offerings, an official said, reports Nikkei Asia. Binance commits to Ontario shutdown, will block new accounts. Binance, the world's largest crypto exchange, said it will stop opening new accounts in Ontario as part of a commitment to the Ontario Securities Commission, OSC, to cease operations in Canada's most populous province. The exchange released an undertaking on Tuesday its dollars 119 meters in BTC shore positions were liquidated as the price surged well above the United States dollars 40,000 level. According to the crypto research and investment firm CoinShares, digital asset investment products saw inflows of United States dollars 36 meters last week, despite the tensions in Ukraine, which turned into a full-scale war on Thursday. Out of this total, United States dollars 17 meters were added to Bitcoin investment products, marking its fifth consecutive week of inflows, the firm wrote. It's worth noting that the inflows were smaller than a week ago, when United States dollars 109 meters flowed into digital asset investment products in total, and United States dollars 89 meters of those went to Bitcoin-backed products. Commenting on Bitcoin's current setup from a technical analysis standpoint, Hong Kong-based crypto financial services firm Babel Finance said in its latest weekly report that the United States dollars 40,000 mark will be a watershed for Bitcoin, and that it could indicate further bullishness in the near term. In the short term, United States dollars 40,000 will become a watershed. That is to say, more traders may be mobilized if the price can return to above United States dollars 40,000, the firm said in its report, which was published just before BTC broke through the key level. Meanwhile, others focused on how the latest gains for Bitcoin and the rest of the crypto market have come at a time when stocks have seen mixed performance, which they said could point to a decoupling of the two asset classes. We have seen crypto be correlated closely to the US stock market for months, but Bitcoin is showing signs of decoupling from this correlation in the short term Marcus Saturio, an analyst at the digital asset broker Global Block, said in email comments. He added that the top cryptocurrency is likely being fueled by the narrative of being a permissionless and censorship resistant way of transferring value, and said it is fascinating that it has even outperformed the traditional safe haven gold. A similar sentiment was also shared by Michael Morch, executive director and risk management at crypto hedge fund ARK36, who said a potential decoupling from risk assets is taking place, and that Bitcoin is gaining prominence as censorship-resistant money. 
Are we, therefore, seeing the beginnings of a wider acceptance of Bitcoin as a hedge not only for investors, but also for ordinary sittings? The company is a technology developer in the institutional DeFi space creating a proprietary system named MetaBridge. While the development of MetaBridge is in its nascent build-out phase, Liquid Meta has active liquidity mining operations which earns tokens, yields, for providing liquidity to various DeFi liquidity pool protocols. This operation is generating revenue, and due to relatively low operational expense, OPEX, costs, could generate substantial free cash flow in year one. Note, Liquid Meta has not provided financial or operational guidance. Despite a promising foundation which includes a cashed-up balance sheet and emerging tech stack, how much will Decentraland cost in 2025, or how much will Decentraland cost in 10 years? Guessing price fluctuations and predicting future prices is a hell of a task. Decentraland Price Prediction 2022 it appears that by 2022, Decentraland, Mana, prices will hit a level similar to their previous all-time high. For 2022, we can expect the average rate to be $3.70. If everything goes smoothly, we predicted that Decentraland's maximum price could be up to $4.21 in 2022. Of course, there are chances that the market will fall after a long bull run, and this is normal for the cryptocurrency market. Decentraland Course Forecast 2023 Mana has great potential, with certain interactions and innovations, it is possible to increase the number of users in advertising. If the market focuses on investing in Decentraland, the price could rise much higher. By 2023, it may reach a maximum value of $6.18. Mana is expected to reverse slightly if the market goes down. The year 2023 could end with an average price of $5.37, a minimum price of $5.19, and a maximum price of $6.18. Decentraland Course Prediction 2024. In 2024, with wider adoption in partnerships between other important blockchain networks, Decentraland price will skyrocket. The maximum trading price could reach $9.01 in 2024. The price ranges will be very trendy if we stick to them. If all goes well, we can expect an average price of $8.04 with a maximum price of $9.01 for 2024. Price Mana Forecast 2025. For a long-term forecast of the Decentraland price, basic analysis is important. In terms of industry benefits, the native token offers several. The autonomy of the digital economy makes it ideal. As DAP and stablecoins evolve, the network offers competitive programmable payment, logistics, and storage options. There is a possibility that the average price of mana will rise to around $11.46 by 2025 if the idea attracts more investors. For 2025, the year could end with a maximum price of $13.49 with a minimum price. Level $11.13. Mana Rate Prediction 2026. Mana will be seen as the best option, and with a huge community, the Decentraland rate will reach new highs. Price swings are hard to predict, especially if the market is more bullish or bearish than ever. For the year 2026, the Decentraland rate will be almost $16.85. The maximum bet we can get is $20.02. Decentraland average price prediction for the end of 2026 could be around $17.30. A huge price turnover is expected in the range determined by the cryptocurrency market. Mana price prediction 2027. A flawless approach to this currency can be found on many websites and forums. According to this prediction platform, Decentraland will remain at its current level for a very long time. By 2027, Mana is expected to peak at $29.37. The minimum bid could rise to $24.21 if the market turns bullish.